Thanks guys. Meetings were held today to discuss new changes to SEM 100. Now this is a required course for all incoming Syracuse students and there's a few changes coming to the course in the hopes that this will increase a sense of belonging among students. SEM 100 is going through a redesign. This six week class was made in response to the Theta Tau incident in 2018. Not Again SU has called for SEM 100 reforms in their new list of demands. And the university is starting their own set of changes to SEM 100 with the SEM 100 curriculum. There were two meetings today about the new changes with potential course facilitators. Provost, faculty fellow, and associate professor Jeff Mangram led the meetings. Mangram says they're using data from previous courses to change the curriculum now. And we went around and talked with them and we asked them, how did it go, what went well, um, what did you do differently? And we found out that, that they did a number of things differently and we saw some, some patterns that we then are trying to mimic now. Some of the main changes, no book next semester. The book just it didn't work for a variety of reasons. The time of the course is moving up too. A lot of students at 6.30, they just were hungry essentially and they were tired. So we had the fundamentals that we got to get the students um, involved with in SCM 100 between 9 and 5. Something they're keeping from last semester's course, strong relationships between facilitators and students. Mangram says those relationships allow students to be vulnerable throughout the course and learn more that we've got to intentionally model certain behaviors that we think is going to promote not only community, but this kind of cross-cultural, cross-racial di racial dialogue that we want. Mangram says this course cannot ignore what's happening at Syracuse right now. He says facilitators need to lean into what he calls hot moments on campus. And we're going to train the facilitators to lean into these hot moments, not avoid them as though nothing's happening on this campus that is of importance. In fact, they're going to, they're going to, they're going to have to be able to facilitate a discussion about the very issues that are happening on this campus. Applications to be a SEM 100 facilitator are on Syracuse's career management webpage known as Handshake. And these applications are due by March 2nd. Also, faculty and staff are welcome to apply as well as any junior, senior, or graduate student to help lead discussions throughout the course.